How does it feel being recognized by the city that you've been working and living in for so long? It really is an honor, and I, and I mean that. And I've had a lot of accolades, and I appreciate all of them. But to be honored in the council chambers in the city in which you live, with so many familiar people there, and so many of them Kings fans, is indeed a great honor for me. And, and I just truly appreciated everything today. Did you know or did you have an inkling that you would be getting your own statue? I kind of had an inkling that that was going to come up, but uh, they didn't want to say anything about that. Uh, I really still can't believe that. You know, it just never enters your mind that some of these things are going to happen. Never did I think there'd be a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame or in the Hockey Hall of Fame in Toronto, the Kings Hall of Fame. And so many things have happened. Uh, capped off by two Stanley Cup championships and uh, I look back over those years I can't believe it's been that many years until a, a person would come up to me a father at a Kings game he'd have his 10 year old son with him and say the father would say I listened to you when I was in grade school and all of a sudden it would hit me how many years I've been doing this and what a great great ride it has been. And your wife, she's been with you by your side during this whole time. How does she feel about all these uh, accolades and recognition, especially, again, with the city and, and the statue? Well, she loves it. She was not a hockey fan growing up. She's from southern Wisconsin, and we got into hockey at the University of Wisconsin when I was doing their games, and she goes to every home game that's possible. She does have some conflicts once in a while, but she wants to be there all the time. And uh, that was a great support for me, especially when you're on the road so much of the year uh, that she was home and uh, taking care of things, raising the children, and still a great fan. I think every announcer needs to have a wife who is a fan of the game he's doing so they can understand why you're gone, why you're on the road, why you're not home when things happen, and they understand that because they are such great fans. Lastly, uh, if you could give a message or send out a message to all of us, uh, the rest of the Angelinos out there who are big fans, what would that message be? Well, it would be that uh, I may not be doing the games, but continue your loyalty and your support of this team, and we're going to enjoy another Stanley Cup championship very soon. Thanks for your support.